reasons to why a child might worry most of the times. The first reason, it could be uncertainty. If your child has an exam or he um, uh, has an, uh, a social uh, event, or, um, the child might worry about that thing because he doesn't know what is going to be there, how it's going to be there. Another reason is because uh, high expectations. If people around him or uh, the coaches or the teachers have high expectations um, of the child, the child might feel worried, might feel anxious. If the child feels this pressure of performing very, very well, the child might feel anxiety. Personal experiences. If your child has gone through a um, challenging, a uh, traumatic event in the past, it might left a um, long impact on the child's mental well-being. Bullying, for example. Reason number four, lack of control. If your child feels out of control of certain situation, if your child doesn't know how the outcome is going to be, uh, your child might worry about the outcome or the negative consequences. Fear of the unknown. A child might worry most of the times because uh, he, he doesn't know how to do things, how he's going to be. And for this reason, he is worrying a lot, or she. The child might worry a lot about uh, things that might happen in the future. The child might worry about different situations, overthinking. If your child has already formed a habit in his mind of overthinking things, then this can be another reason why your child worries most of the time. Environmental factors, such as Family stress or peer pressure can contribute to why a child might worry most of the times. These are some of the reasons to why your child might worry most of the times. Now, important it is to find out why your child is worried most of the times and to help your child with his worries. If you cannot help your child, it is very important to ask for help because things can get worse if the child doesn't get help, doesn't receive help to stop those uh, worry, uh, anxious thoughts. If the child doesn't get help, then you will start to notice that the child's life will be limited. The child will want to avoid trying new things, to go to new activities, to sometimes even going to school, uh, going to parties. So it is very important to find out what your child uh, is anxious about, or worrying about, and then help him or her. If you cannot help, ask for support, ask for help.